Yeah. Did they ever stand a chance? No. Like, did they truly ever stand a chance? Absolutely not. Whoops, I accidentally hit the mic. <laughs> Didn't Tay Zonde follow you on Twitter? He did! For no reason! Yeah, like, Chocolate Rain Guy, he just followed me on Twitter. I was like, whoa. <laughs> Why? Maybe it's like a marketing thing. He wants people to remember Chocolate Rain. It's a good song. And like I, it worked because like as soon as I saw like oh Tay Sunday is that the Chocolate Rain guy? I listen to it. I went to go listen to Chocolate Rain. I'm like oh yeah, it is him. Yeah, he has aged well. Yeah, he did. he's older than us. Yeah, he looks young. <laughs> but it's it's hard to believe like people who were popular like at the beginning of YouTube. Like, somebody who was probably at the beginning of YouTube just followed me on Twitter for no reason. For it. <laughs> Did he follow someone else, too, that we know? I don't know. <laughs> and then Ajura died, but this time in red and white. So, you want to hear something weird? Yeah. One of my old bosses mm -hmm. added me on Facebook. Okay. And then I get a message from Stacy later that night. Who is his name? I was like, why? I was like, wait, why? Cause he liked one of my selfies from like three years ago. Oh, he creeping. So that means he went through all of her pictures. He creeping. Hmm. Well, but to be fair, Stacy can take some really good pictures. <laughs> she does have great pictures. Like I would kill to be that photogenic, right? Be but like, <laughs> in case you didn't know, my roommate's name is Stacy. I don't think I've ever mentioned her. By but name. like every every picture I take, I look like a fucking Bigfoot. <laughs> like. <laughs> Far away and blurry, and I look kind of weird. <laughs> that reminded me of that time we were driving, and that guy walked out in front of us, and he was doing the Bigfoot pose. Oh, yeah. And you see, yeah, he said, Why are you walking out in the middle of the road looking like fucking Bigfoot? <laughs> yeah, like, here in North Carolina, like, people just want to die in auto related accidents. Like, they don't turn, turn signals on, they don't brake. Like, good. And they fucking walk out into traffic like like they're impervious to cars. Remember that time when the dude yelled at you, My bad? <laughs> they knew. They knew they were in the wrong. Or that time fucking... That one time we were driving, and Tasty was like, Why is that scooter riding itself? <laughs> what? <laughs> there was a black guy. Oh, God. But what you couldn't that? see him? No! <laughs> oh, God. It's terrible. Her boyfriend bought the same thing. I was like, oh, guys. <laughs> what the? Where are we now? Oh, no. Gaia got fucked up. Isn't Gaia like Earth? Yeah, it's Earth. Since you were here last. Gaia means Mother Earth. I'm sorry that we're not all culturally active like you are. I mean, like, if you've seen anything Wonder Woman related, that's... Mother Gaia. Oh. There's yeah. no Wonder Who's Woman's a lesbian now. Cool. <laughs> I guess. I mean, like... The only thing interesting Wonder Woman has coming up is, like, the movie. The movie looks pretty good. And I don't know. I, I've never read the comics, so I can't really be a judge on that. No, I, I've read a few. Like, with her fight with Ares. The, I only got DM battle points because I didn't do the tutorial. Oh, man. Oh, well. Move on, we got time for one more episode, probably. But, uh... Yeah, like... There's some weird shit going on with that Berserk reference right there, but, no, uh, There's some weird shit going on in comic books right now. We got, like... A barren land somewhere on Gaia. We got Civil War Two. What do you think? It's become a tad desolate since you were here last. I can hear thunder in the distance. Can you see the lightning? It is as red as blood. It is, it is red as bread. So you remember. <laughs> yes, the threat of the Goma still remains even now. Curious as to what your former comrades have been doing? Hmm. Over there. Have a look. <laughs> Whenever he said that, I just imagined, like, Day is walking in with a coffee mug. What do we do today? He turns to a calendar and just says evil <laughs> on it. <laughs> they, they let the Goma. Not quite. This was the work of your own race, the demigods. What? They now have control over the world and do as they please. That can't be. 
Guys, we're going to control you now. Is somebody from the couch? Okay. <laughs> a lot can change in 12,000 years. If you don't believe me, why don't you go see for yourself? Shut up. Good answer, Roger. There's the famous Roger Anger. Well then, this world shall be your playground. Good, good answer. After a long slumber, Osura awakens on Gaia. 12,000 years have passed. The world he knew was no it more. It turns out Osura was asleep for a really long the time. The between the humans and the Goma like Sting? continued to like Sting. As Osura witnesses the Goma Because, you know, village, TNA is not a thing. Appears. <laughs> what was Sting doing? Sleeping. <laughs> he was never wrestling, he was just sleeping. Up on the rafters. <laughs> <laughs> Then came down when Seth Rollins came out and pointed at him. Yep. <laughs> Isn't that what he did for weeks? No, like... Here's, we're gonna talk about wrestling, guys. <laughs> if it's not, about, it's not your thing, I'm sorry. First, he appeared and he came down to the ring and pointed at Triple H. And then he wrestled Triple H and lost. Then he came down to the ring and he pointed at, at Seth Rollins. Then he destroyed a statue of Seth Rollins. Then pointed at him one more time. Then he pointed at him one more time. Then lost. And then lost. Man, what a great career! What what an amazing WWE run. <laughs> His WCW career was good though. I still remember when Bobby Lashley came down and pointed and didn't, didn't show up. For oh years. yeah, where he came back and just pointed and he just left and left. He, did, he, did, he, did, he didn't show up for years. Yeah, and now he's relevant again. <laughs> On TNA, right? Yeah. <laughs> so what is their language? I don't know. Look at that guy. He, He's got to be incredibly strong. He is whacking the shit out of that bell. And Oscar's too, too, too busy thinking about guts. Yep. You know what's going to stop these giant primordial things? This wooden gate right here. <laughs> Nothing says safety and security like, like that wooden, wooden gate. gate. <laughs> you want to play Junkin? That wooden gate that has an open spot over there. Look! They can, <laughs> they can break through stone, but that wooden gate right there? No. I still love how the fucking bleachers of fucking level was incalculable. <laughs> we don't know how evil this thing is. How evil is this thing? These things are just monkeys, aren't they? Yep, they're corrupted monkeys. Which is pretty much what Planet of the Apes is about. Monkeys are smart. Oh no. Really wants me to lock on, doesn't it? Yeah. I mean, lock on helps him. Really helps with boss fights. Boss fights, it automatically locks on. Did you see that? Yes. I just fucking flung him. See, this is all remastered. The frames per second will hold up. Yeah. Well, you say that, but in RE4, there's still some slowdown. The Dead Rising has absolutely no slowdown. Which is amazing. Because I remember, like, in 2, whenever you use, like, any of like, the big combo weapons, it would, it would fucking go nuts. The frame rate would just die. Like, you might as well be playing the game under fucking water. Oh, here come these totally capable things. Here come the putty patrol. Yep. You have returned. Oh shit. Is that is that robot Akuma? Rokuma? We shall send you back to the shadows of death. Along with the Goma. Yes, we killed these unkillable things. They're dead, we promise. Yo, you remember that video where it was like, uh, The Walking Dead Season 2 ending leaked? <laughs> what was it? And it was Kenny coming down from the heavens? <laughs> with that really cool song? <laughs> Fucking Kenny, man. He has the best facial hair in gaming, but he just murders indiscriminately. <laughs> oh, God. Why do you like <laughs> Look him? at this! Look at this! <laughs> Why do you like him so much, Ricky? With me and my me and my dad played The Walking Dead, he was our bro. He was your bro. Did you murder people? Yes. <laughs> now to be fair, that dude at the end of season one deserved it. 
What, uh, the, the kidnapper. The, oh, yeah. What about the Salt Lake guy? The guy you killed at Salt Lake? I don't remember. Uh, Lily's dad, I think. Yes. <laughs> Can't he just fucking, we got no other way, he just fucking throws the Salt Lake on him? <laughs> for purification. God, that was, that was terrible. Those are the greatest pants in gaming. They are. I, I would imagine those really things at the bottom would get in the way of walking, but I'm pretty sure his thighs do that. Sometimes you gotta think, how does he walk? I mean, like, look at that! He's basically Karnov. What a lucky Yo, he does look like Karnov. He's actually fatter than Karnov. Karnov is a- I would like a new Karnov game. Yeah, a 3D not, action Karnov game. Considering Data East doesn't exist anymore, we're not getting that. I know, but that'd be cool. Well, I mean, like, SNK has the rights. Boom! Right. Boom! Big boot. SNK has the rights to him and all the Data East stuff. Hundreds of work. Like, what I'm looking forward to is the remake of Garo, though. The PS4, the PS4 remaster that's coming out. I don't, I don't, I don't, I won't, I won't. Bro, when you think, when you talk about good SNK games, Garo is up there. Bam! Damn. By you, the guy I love, Mark of the Wolves. I appreciate it. Let me, if you want to play some Karnov. Okay, I have it on the computer. You have it on the US. I have it on Fight Kids. No, like Karnov's Revenge. Not Karnov, Karnov. You know, the fighting game. That is somehow a sequel to the platformer. <laughs> That's really weird. I thought we were going to miss him for a minute. Right, because that can happen, can't it? Mm-hmm. You have to refill the bar. Oh, uh, just like the last, like, half of it. Not last third of it, really. Oh, I remember I hate finding this thing. It's really repulsive. Oh, God! He's so evil. What? It's a vacuum? Oh, it's taking this soul! No! He done took my nigga's soul. No. Iron Reaver, Soul Stealer. <laughs> oh. How anime of him. What would Inuyasha do? I bet it's Windscar. <laughs> <laughs> and he took that shit. Oh god, this this entrance is dramatic. We have no idea who that could be. Oh, it's wise. <laughs> dun dun dun. What Lord Deus spoke of was true. It has been a What your dietitian spoke was true too, but you didn't listen to him. <laughs> Look at him, he's unimpressed. Oscar just does not care. Nope. God, I love this character. He is so cool, even though he's this literally angry guy, yeah. but it works. He's angry potato, but... <laughs> what Lord Deus spoke of was true. It has been a while. So is that what Lord Deus said? I never actually thought is that why it's true? Did he just go like... He just walked in one day and go like... It has been a long time, traitor. <laughs> And everybody just believed him. <laughs> and, and everybody was like, whatever, man. <laughs> <laughs> you do you. <laughs> Except for Wise, and he was just like, ah, This must be true! <laughs> just slam like this giant jug of beer down. <laughs> His whole body is a physics engine. Well, I mean, like, he said kneel down for one of the seven deities. That's like saying respect me because I'm a Baldwin. I'm surprised he wasn't a costume for Rufus. If you're not Alec Baldwin, nobody cares that you're a Baldwin. Just like if you're not Deus, nobody cares that you're a deity. Shut him up. Do it! Yeah! Bam! Oh, that's gotta hurt pride. In his tiny head. Your ears have become so sullied. That you cannot even comprehend words of purity. Feel my wrath. I remember for shutting him up, you got a trophy. Yeah, you're gonna say that to the god of wrath, heal your wrath. Oh, 
Oh, oh. Oh, those still hit too. Bang. He's so fat, his hitbox was still in the air when it wasn't. I like that his character model shakes whenever you hit him with the bullets. Right. Oh, that was good. This is this game is glorious. It is. It's so cool. Oh no! Here comes the big attack. There it is. The big attack. <laughs> Boom! Let's go mess him up. <laughs> Get that shit out of here. Finish him. Get that ass bam. <laughs> How did he grab his head so tiny? I don't know. <laughs> he did. Nah, he ain't dead. <laughs> Once again, why not do this at the start of the fight? I get dramatic tension and all that, <laughs> actually. <laughs> this fight would have been very dumb if it was just this part. Right? Yeah. His power was that he just got big. Yep. He's like Apache Hawk. Apache Chief? Apache Chief. I combine Apache Chief and, and T-Hawk. -Hawk. That's a pairing that's too much for this world. <laughs> <laughs> or Ant-Man when he turns into Giant Man. My daughter. Mithra's power. Oh, you did stuff to my daughter. I, I must kill you now. No, Jessica! Tell me what you've done with her. Let me slowly you punch you. <laughs> right? Bye, ah, fucking cock teases. Yeah, I remember the demo was the fight against him. Yeah, it was. And the fight against August. August yeah. They picked but... <laughs> two of the coolest fights to put in the yeah. game. Let's call, it a, let's call it a session here. All right. Alright, so yeah guys, uh, that's it for the first recording session. Like, comment, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Still love this game. Yep, we'll see you guys in the next few parts. So, see you later. <laughs>